If you drove this area of Hurstbourne in the past week, chances are you might have seen Robert Simpson, a man who stood by the side of the road for several days holding a sign, not asking for a handout, but for a job. The work is physical, but it's steady, and that's what Robert Simpson is grateful for. Well, it feels excellent. It's, it's, a, it's a blessing. Just days before, Simpson was standing along the highway, pleading for work. Dozens driving by took pictures, shared hundreds of times on social media. Kind of take the rough paper edges off. Business owner Kyle Clark saw one of those posts and decided to give Simpson a chance. Sent a text just telling him who I was. Um, he immediately reached back out to me. I didn't even ask him what he was paying. I just came. <laughs> and he's been taking care of me ever since. Wednesday marked his second day at Green Star Home Remodeling, and according to his new boss who picks him up since he's without a car, Simpson was eager to get started. He was calling me this morning like, hey, just, just want to make sure you're on the way, uh, you know, that I didn't forget about him. Simpson lost regular work, and as a result, the family's apartment in the midst of COVID-19. His new boss started a fundraiser so that the family, including Simpson's six-year-old stepson, could move out of the hotel where they've been staying for seven weeks. On Wednesday, Simpson was shocked to learn about the fundraiser and the generosity of strangers. It's $14,000 for you and your family. <laughs> that's, 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 that's a blessing. That's God's work. That's God's work. Simpson was clearly overwhelmed, left at a loss for words. I never imagined that like it. And he says he never imagined that by simply holding a sign, asking to earn an honest living, he'd be doing exactly that just a few days later. Nobody gonna give you nothing. You got to go out there and get it. Lauren Adams, WLKY News. A great story, the happy ending. Thank you, Lauren.